first of all welcome to my channel so today we are going to do a dccn based project which is smoke detection and fire extinguisher so for that we are going to make this network okay um, now all the components which are there used like garage door window and door and all this you can find by going there here and write whatever you want like for example you want siren so when you write this you can see there and just drag it from here you get you want um, fire sprinkler so you need to just write and you wait there okay uh, now um, for example you want windows so you can find everything okay now uh, <clears throat> we want this uh, home gateway so you need to write dlc okay so you get this now the second question um, is how will you going to connect this? These are connected wirelessly. For that, you need to go onto this first of all and go into the configuration and uh, wireless. So you can see change this SSID. Okay, so make it anything to because it, it should not be similar to this. Initially, we are doing that. Okay. And whosoever you want to connect wirelessly, just click on it and go into advanced IO configuration. Change this to PT IoT and then one W, which is say it's wireless. Okay, then go into the configuration and change the display name. We change the display name to make it easy because at, uh, after some time you need uh, uh, different names and it will easy to differentiate among these okay okay so then go to the wireless and change the ssid like you can see it is connected to this why because here it's written home gateway which is home gateway this okay the ssid of this is home gateway once we say two and cut it it will going to connect with this okay you can see it is connected to this now you can do uh, the same with all just go to advance io configuration changes to uh, this okay then go to configuration change the name to make it easy fire sprinkler okay then you can see again it is connected to this because the side is where is this okay once you move it to and cut then going to connect with this wait for a while okay now it's connected okay so we are working uh, we are going to work on this network but i'm going to give you a uh, uh, example how can you uh, make this network okay uh, so let me delete this because we are not going to use this just click on the uh, cross sign and say yes and the all the devices we, we want to delete just click on it and then again go and save it otherwise it will keep deleting uh, on which you uh, you know click right okay after this you need to make the same changes uh, the same way that i did in the example okay then you will see that all of these get connected okay fine oh let me show you once again go to the advance go to io configuration it will not initially 1w change it into uh, to 1w then go to configuration okay then change the display name and gateway changes at uh, dhcp here also and here let's say home gateway okay um go to wireless and see the ssid should be ssid of this okay if you are choosing uh, if you're if you're using multiple number of home gateway then you need to keep I on this also that uh, what is the home gateway you are connecting your devices with okay um, and also change the IP configurations to at DHCP here and here okay and with all of these you are going to do the same thing just go to advanced go to IO configuration and change it then here you change it then wireless just to show you i'm opening all of them so that if you get any query you can just do 
sorry. Here. Okay. Then get its door. Do advance. I have configuration. You can see in configuration and this. Okay, IoT server should be home gateway and all of that. Then here also. Okay. Let's go to advance configuration in this. Now at the end you need to uh, in, uh, the project, project is about smoke detection right so you need to uh, produce the smoke from somewhere so we are using the cars here to produce the smoke so just click on the car go to advance IO configuration and see no changes are required there we are not changing the display name also you can change it uh, but it's okay not to do the same and then this so with all three i'm going to show you so that you will not get confused with this try configuration then configuration okay and this also fonts have configuration okay that's it now we need to go into the smartphone and we need to see the smartphones also or uh, desktop and IoT monitor. Here you can see this. Okay. Um, so the smoke detection, if you see it is this value, okay, or, or could be less than this also. So uh, after that, we need to go on to the condition. It this condition button could be here also, but or could be here so you need to go to the condition and i had already added two conditions here you can add like just go into the add okay name the condition for example uh, i named it um wait. like i named it smoke detector and the condition is if smoke detector level is more than 0.3 you can change this value also like uh, initially i made it 0.5 Okay, uh, so depend on uh, the circumstances, you can change the condition. Okay, so simply uh, like go name, okay, then say all, it's already there maybe. Uh, condition uh, on, on which device you want to put the condition. So you want to put here the smoke condition, then level, then more than or equals to it could be different also depending on the condition you want to show then set if if uh, there is only one then you can keep adding like this okay just go on any okay so this is like that but we are not going to use this because we already made uh, for the siren also so i'm going to reduce okay so this is how you need to go like siren choose the siren say on and this will come itself so what we are what it trying to say is when the level of the smoke will go beyond 0 0.3 then siren will on fire sprinkler uh, status will draw that means it's on drawer will lock uh, will going to unlock from lock to unlock window will going to be on and garage door will going to be on that means open okay similarly we made the smoke detector off that means when it is zero less than 0 0.5 you can change also right if it's less than like three let me get three so if it is less than 0 0.3 then uh, siren will uh, off and fire sprinkle will off so this is like that door will lock keep lock now uh, window will uh, not open and garage door will not open um, then say okay for the first time if you are making the conditions and that's it and now you need to produce the smoke to produce the smoke you need to click along with uh, clicking the alt button okay wait sorry so this is click and along with that uh, alt button it 
could be happen for the first time okay now after a while you will see like uh, you can see window will op going to open door why is it so it will go on to smartphone again and uh, going on to uh, desktop sorry desktop iot monitor and if you see the uh, level you can see it is keep increasing and when if it will become more than 0.3 this will happen whatever we say like window will open door will unlock okay and if it is not then it will uh, the action will not occur so this is uh, all about this project if you found out any kind of query you can simply comment down below and that's it